again everyone, Age of June here, and we are back with another League of Legends game. It uh, looks like I am going to be banning again, and I don't really like that. Ban Zack, okay. Don't know if I trust not banning Thresh just because they have first pick. Last time I really shouldn't have banned Thresh, but uh... I guess I'll go ahead and ban Thresh. Uh, really not sure though. Yeah. Yeah, I will. Yep. Yeah. So I will be. End I'm gonna end up going uh, Tarek first pick again, and that should be fine. Looks like Dachshund's probably going to go mid. Hmm. I guess Blitz. That's fine. I'm not really scared of him, but honestly, there's no reason not to. So, let's crank it is. Alright, so, we'll see who they end up picking. And then I'm going to go ahead and pick my support. Hopefully Doxon gets his role. Um, just so you know, this is my third promotion series game. I did end up losing the last one. It was kind of sad, obviously, by the fact that I'm in third. Um, More than just I probably stones. should have left Thresh unbanned and first an picked him, because power. I am good at him. I don't know. I was just having a mental dirt moment, and I was afraid, and I decided against him. So I really, really shouldn't have done that. I really should have gone Thresh, just because I do really enjoy him, and I haven't played him in a while. And it might have gone better. But I didn't. So whatever the case may be, I am now in this particular group. So far there is no person who is may or may not be trash talking in chat, which is a good sign. Because I think that kind of hurt us last time. Because I think he actually was trash talking from the beginning. Not a good idea, guys. Don't trash talk your team from the beginning. I mean, he could have been joking around. I really don't know. It did not seem like it. Judging by his later behavior, though, so... Anyway, we'll see who I end up being teamed up with down bottom. Kind of looking forward to it. Hoping I'll get out of Silver 3 here. Not sure if it'll happen. If not, then uh, back to Silver 3 for me, and I'm fine with that. You know? It's not not some terrible thing. I am going to be against Janna from the looks of it. Annoying. Or Nami. Well, we'll see. It'll be alright. So, either way, I'm definitely hoping I get out. Just because I, I do enjoy getting out of the... I enjoyed the idea of getting out of Silver 3. We'll have to see. It would be kind of cool to get out my first attempt. As long as I don't then sink back in. Because that always sucks. That, that, that happened to me my first time I got to Silver 3. Right after I got there the first time, I lost a whole bunch of games in a row and I ended up going back down to Silver 4. I got promoted not too long after, but it was still kind of sad. Those to me are the most stressful games. The games in which I'm actually, you know, just got promoted and I don't want to lose. I mean, the first couple of games, you're not going to get demoted. But even still, just knowing that it's there, knowing that it, you know, no, knowing that it's a possibility. Okay, so we've got Teemo and Kale. So, I guess Woozy is going to be my ADC. Come on, top kill mid. I'm guessing. That, that, that's my guess. We'll have to see though. Ramus being jungle is kind of cool. I have not seen a Ramus jungle in quite some time. You really don't see Ramus that much at all at the moment. So it's kind of cool to see one again. Hopefully that is all great. I would imagine that it is actually easier now just because people haven't played against Ramus in so long and you kind of forget what sort of things he's capable and such. Capable of and such. So we'll have to see. And hopefully he doesn't go ahead and turret dive like the Amumu did last game. That was pretty special. Not his best decision, but it could have gone better. I think I could have healed him on that first dive that got first blood. I think I could have healed him and it might have gone better. But I don't know. 
doesn't matter now because that game is over. And this game's beginning. So hopefully it's gonna go well. Hopefully my client doesn't crash again. Is it going to crash? Is it no, it did not crash. That is great news. Okay, that makes me happy. So it did not crash. I'm actually top elo and last season two of the people were gold. That's kind of silly. I wonder what they are this season. They could still be gold. The, the, the way the new league system works, it's entirely possible that they are gold five and that they have fallen below me in MMR. I really don't know. My MMR seems to be high silver and low gold at the moment. Because that's what I get matched against. Whereas when I was in Silver 4, a lot of times I was actually matched against Bronze people. So it's kind of cool being able to see your MMR improve like that. I mean, there's not a not an easy way to do it. It's all guesswork. There is no number for you to look at. There are estimators. I don't remember what it was. It was like op.gg slash elo uh, MMR, something like that. That one, it actually does estimate your... MMR, but there is no accurate way to just pull it out of the client. That That is all an estimation based on win losses and stuff. So it, it may not be right. But you, you can look at the people you're against and see what exactly they are. And if you're against low golds and you're still silver, so that means your MMR is going to be pretty decent at least. It could just mean theirs is really low as well. But you never know. Alright, so I am purple side. Start out with my usual thing. I'm not sure what sort of things are going to happen. The patch went down last night, and some of the items have changed. Runic Bulwark is gone. Gone. And Lock of the Iron Solari now builds from the Aegis of the Legion. So, really, junglers in my elo don't tend to build Runic Bulwark anyway, or Lock of the Iron Solari. So it shouldn't matter too much. I'll just go straight for Lock of the Iron Solari, which is actually better for me. The only bad thing about it is it actually does do less. Less good stuff for us. So that's kind of disappointing, but it should still be okay. I do like the active from that locket, and it will let me get the locket earlier than I normally did. Hello. They're kind of hanging around here. Interesting. Not sure why. I'm a stealthy, do they? They don't. Sapphire. Okay. Alright, so they were just kind of looking around. I don't know if they were about to ward or what. Timo! Opal. <laughs> you don't see Timo much either. People hate Timo. Not sure why people hate Timo. I think Timo's funny. He's a silly person. Ruby for vigor. Are, are these guys invading? Seriously? Ah, they're just uh, planting a ward here. Interesting. So they may end up invading, actually. Sapphire. It is definitely possible. They do have that. Okay. So we got a decent amount out of her this time with that little hit there and I think they might have come out slightly behind on that. I mean we did take a decent amount of, or I took a decent amount of damage from Ash but I'm pretty tanky as is and I'm just healing it back up. So we should actually still be okay. I think she ended up taking more damage than we did but uh, they do have heals as well and Nami usually gets hers a bit earlier than I would. So. She'll probably start healing that up. I may end up going for my heal second, depending on uh, how things are going here. Yeah, I probably will. I already used my pot. Who is their jungler? Their jungler is Jarvan. Okay. So, as of right now, I'm not going to worry about warding Tribush, as we are not pushed that far out. So there's no real, no real big deal about it. But eventually, I will end up going ahead and doing so. Oh my. Oh, oh, oh. This Nami's good. Unfortunately, Misfortune got hit there. And she's kind of extending a little bit too far forward. Which is not a good thing. And that actually did cement it. I am going for my heal second. I'm definitely doing that. 
And Nami, uh, I think that was just a regular ward. Okay. That's fine then. There we go. Now I can start healing. Okay, there is a ward. That dragon, 337. I probably won't remember the timer later, but it is there. Okay. Unfortunately, that was first blood mid, but top uh, mid also died to Ramus. So it ended up being an even one for one. The only thing that makes it not even is the fact that uh, first blood happened. But that should be okay, really. And then Ramus is just protecting there. Misfortune's taking a lot of damage from this Ash. Ash is quite good. And we're gonna have to defend our tower here. Misfortune might end up having to fall back here. Okay. So we actually did a decent amount of damage back to them because I was able to stun Ash under the tower. I think Nami tanked it so that she wouldn't have to, but while she was tanking it, you know, she's taking a lot of damage. Ash took a lot of damage from me and from, I think she took one tower shot. I'm not sure. But I think so. So, Misfortune was forced to go back, unfortunately. But we should still be okay. Ramus has gone back. Kayla's back in lane. Kayla's pretty nasty late game. So, I think we may be okay as long as, you know, we make it to late game. Kayla's nasty. Teemo's not the nastiest in the world, but he can be nasty, depending. I don't know what he's going to be going. Can't really look at the moment. Whether he's going to be going AP or Bruiser or what here, but. Okay. She's got one little hit off on her. Unfortunately, she took that. And in comes Ramus. He is going in. I'm going to run over this. Oh, oh, he went back. He went back. Don't want to keep going that way then. So he realized that the ward picked him up and he took off. My ward is now down. And I will place that as soon as I can. He actually might have been able to catch them, but I don't know. He is going in for a gank mid. There are two people there, so it's going to be a two-person... I don't know who's going to win this. Jarvan escaped, but they're going in on Kassadin. Kale went down again. And is Ramus going to get Kassadin? He did. So it's actually a repeat of what happened before. And he got Jarvan. That's great. I like that. So we came out ahead this time. That is great news. You go ahead and put that there. Just get a little harass off on her. Not bad. She did a whole lot less to me than I did to her. <laughs> All right. Ooh. We're actually doing pretty well right now. She's getting a decent amount of CS. Ash really isn't getting how much harass at the moment. And I'm not having to use my ward because we are staying this far back. So we're actually doing all right. I am okay with the way this is going. That ward was 337, 930. Oh, she's gone to reward you. I was about to say that ward's going down very soon, but unfortunately she's rewarding. Yeah. River rewarded. And this does not mean that it's got a prize. Apparently I was slightly out of range there. I was trying to stun her, but it did not work. I was slightly too slow and she got back out of range. Granted, she really didn't do anything to me either, so that's fine. That's fine. And I'll just heal us back up. Most of the damage that we just took is back. So, Ramus looks like he's thinking about stealing that blue buff over there. Which would be kind of cool. Don't hit us, bro. It's not okay. She's pushing us still. She's very heavy pusher. Not really the best of ideas a lot of times. You, you, you want to try to get your enemy to come out, at least sometimes. I mean, it can be okay. Rampage. Nice. Rampage. That is excellent news. Yeah, it can be okay to push if you're pushing them under their tower and making them miss CS. Yes. But... She's actually not managing to do that. She is just pushing and pushing and not really getting much out of it. 
She might make Misfortune lose like one or two CS here or there, but not, not enough to make it worth it. Okay. Misfortune is good at CSing, so that's great. Bot MIA, I'm going to go ahead and reward here. Brilliantly. Don't know where they are. Don't think they're going to go gank mid. That would be silly. Bot lane does not gank much. So that means that we're going to get free farm. Oh, Excuse oh, me. Oh, oh. Sorry. We're going to get a little bit of free farm here. I do want to go back soon because I've got the money for my Philosopher's Stone. And that's a great item to have. Oh, nope. She's back. If I can get her to come out just a little bit, I don't think she knows I'm here. To the best of my knowledge, this isn't warded. Ah, oh, yes! <laughs> Thought I'd be able to take that one, but apparently not. So that was a minor mistake on my part, but honestly, that is still okay. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a pink ward as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring this up so you guys can look at it for a little bit. And, and we're done. I'm gonna go ahead and head back out. So it looks like CS-wise, Misfortune's at 67, Ash is at 65. Misfortune's a little ahead, but they're actually pretty much even. The Ramus is doing great, 401. Kale is actually doing pretty well now. I saw her just chunking that cast in, so she's doing better now than she was before. And Ash is back to auto-pushing. I'm gonna get there in time, though. I do like that little engagement there. That MF ult just shredded them. And coupled with my shatter, it just made them melt completely away. Emerald and it just turned out great for us. I probably... Oh, I, I should not have stayed under the tower that long. I should have let Ramus tank it. But it may have ended up being out okay this way. Just because of the fact that it does mean that Ramus was not quite as low as he would have been otherwise. Okay, we don't want to go in here because there are a ton of minions. It looks like Ramus is coming somewhere. I'm gonna stun her. Ah, Misfortune took a lot of damage there. Well, I was trying to get in range of Ash. There we go. Hello. Fortunately, I have stuff to heal her. Ramus is coming. Emerald for insight. There we go. Nice. That was an excellent gank by Ramus. And I'm gonna go ahead and pink ward dragon. Oh, he pink warded dragon. I like this guy. save my flash for Jarvan, as he does seem to be wanting to come over here. Get rid of this. He did indeed come over here. There's that. Did manage to get the heal off. In comes Cassidin. Oh, the Kale ulti! Oh, I didn't help anyway. That's alright. That ended up being well worth it for us. I do want to go ahead and take this out. Free gold for me and Ramus. Or Ramus and I. Yes. Free gold for Ramus and I. Emerald for yes. I just grammar nazi would myself. I do that from time to time, you know? Ooh, Kale got pretty low there. There 
There we go. That's what I like to see. And we still have that buff, so it's going to rip through the tower. And now it's gone. Oh, Nami's back. Not that we're really afraid of Nami, but... More afraid of her than, you know, had she not been here. Heal myself up. That means I don't have mana for stun, though. Oh, hey, and then I level and I have stun mana for stun now. Alright. So we're just gonna push this. Ash is back up, but she's gonna lose out of some CS here. So, looks like Miss Fortune and I are both gonna go back. I was, I was thinking that too, and she, she agrees. I still have a pink ward from my last back, so I don't need to buy another one of those. I am gonna get my Sight Stone. Not gonna worry about Ruby Sightstone quite yet. Ramus does not appear to be going. I'll ask him if he's going for Ramus. Or uh, I e just. If not, I am. You know, what? I'm just gonna get this for now. Okay. Not sure how already turned into whatever the heck that was. Okay, so on my next back, I'll get started on Aegis and then by proxy, Lock of the Iron Solari. So that's fine. I do have my Ruby Side Stone, which is great. That gives me extra health. It gives me extra wards. That is awesome. I just don't have the aura from the emblem. But honestly, come to think of it, that really doesn't matter anymore. Because it's not nearly as powerful as it used to be. So I'm not really sure that I mind all that much. Oh, 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 I'm going to go ahead and reward up here. I'm going to use a green ward this time because she did not have a pink ward there. Or a ward there. She may end up pinking it soonish. And if she does, I want to be able to repink it and steal her pink. She doesn't even have wards. So yeah. There goes that whole idea, but that's okay. Nice. Oh, how did I take that? Scumbag tower. Okay, that's fine. We actually didn't take too much damage from that. Ah, darn it, Ash. That was mean. I don't think she has a ward in here. I know she doesn't have a ward in there because she had to hawk shot that. She may still have had a ward up here, though. I'm not sure. Kale is now pushing down mid quite hard, which is excellent. And we are still pushing down here, and we may end up getting this tower soon. Darn it, why am I taking these shower shots? Hopefully we'll be able to do some damage to these towers. Okay, so her hawk shot is down now. She does not have a ward here, so now she's having to be very careful. Dang it, was not quite enough. Okay, but Kale's coming in. Kale's probably going to get Ash out of this. She may end up getting Jarvan, too. It's possible. Unfortunately, I don't have a ward in there. Now nah, he's going to be fine. So, Cassidan came in, but Ramus seems to be coming down, too, so that'll be fun. And I am going to go ahead and get started on my Emblem of Valor, like I mentioned before. And what exactly does this do now? Magic resist and health regen. So they wanted to ma nerf magic resist, so they just got rid of the armor. Okay. Alrighty then. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. Um, I am curious when exactly dr dragon's gonna respawn. I do want to see if I can. Dragon, dragon, dragon. 1235, so that would be 1935, I think. Oh, shut down. No, Misfortune's gonna die too! That's terrible news! Oh, she might not. If she can make it to me, I can heal her. No, 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 no. Ah. Oh. 
No, I'll cast it in two. That's terrible. Oh, and I'm gonna die too now. Oh no! That was very, very unfortunate. That was just one bad move after another. And uh, it kind of snowballed out of control there a little bit. So on the plus side, Aegis is cheaper. On the minus side, it doesn't really do too much. Oh! It does still work with my passive, though, on W. So that's good, because it still gives me armor. It's just not as much armor as I would like to my allies. That's fine, though. I am going to go ahead and start continue working on my Lock of the Iron Solari. Uh, yeah, it is probably gone. And apparently I was off on that. I thought it was a 7-minute timer. But, uh, guess not. Yep, it's gone. Darn it. Timo is getting attacked. Timo is probably going to die. He needs to lead him over his shrooms if he can. Oh, he is. Uh, I think he's still going to die. Yeah, he still died. That stinks. We're going to get a tower here. We're probably going to get a tower here as well. No, I'm not sure we'll get the tower here, but I would like to. Hopefully we will. But they're definitely going to get the tower there. Yeah, it's gone. And hopefully Miss Fortune and I will be able to get this tower. I actually did ping that for her, not for you. Yeah, we're going to get this, no problem. It's gone. I got the kill. Woo! Because that means something. And now I can go ahead and ward up their jungle some. Well, soon. Okay. We're here. Is there red here? No. And we're going to come around behind these guys because they are massively overextended. So we are on our way up. Oh, I should probably work on boots too. Come to think of it. Yeah, he's dead. So that wasn't bad at all. We got a kill out of it. Yeah, Kale died on the plus side. So did she. Okay. Uh, I took a little bit of damage there. Oh, that ulti hit me. It's fine. I'm pretty darn tanky. Uh, am I gonna get out? I did get out, but Ramus is not. Ramus is not. His fortune is. Oh, no, no, no. Ah. Uh. Okay, so Timo is taking that tower, which is great news. And Nami was able to push us back with that. Alright, so he did take that tower, and that's great. That is very great. This is going to be forced back there, though. There we go. A little more vision there. And he's going to continue getting vision as well. So I'm going to head back now. I do have Aegis of the Legion. Already. Yeah, just because it's cheaper though. And I'm pretty close to having lock it. After that, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna build, honestly. We'll have to see. Probably, I'll probably go for my Shirelius next. Oh, nice. He's gonna get a free ward kill out of that. With, I think it's his pink, because mine still has not been placed because it hasn't needed to be. But it will soon. I'm gonna go ahead and place it there next. Fortune's mid. Oh, Ramus just went hardcore down there, and I think he's gonna die. That was a terrible decision on his part. And yeah, there's nothing we can do to save him. Ash got a killing spree. No. I hope he's kidding. Ah, I ate it instead of her. Yes! Worth it! <laughs> there's a minor error, well, there's a pretty big error, but in the grand scheme of things, it shouldn't be too bad, I think. We might be able to get this tower. No, it doesn't look like it. Not quite yet. Not quite yet. Alright, so my wards here are wearing off. And that's fine. I can go ahead and replant them. 
One there. Actually, I think I want one there. Gotcha! Ha 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 How do you like that stun? Oh! Oh! Is he gonna? No, he didn't get him. I'm gonna heal him though. I'm gonna put that there. Get rid of the reward. Take that. Bet you didn't expect that one, did you guys? Have some health, sir. Have some health. Maybe you're just pushing. So it's looking promising so far. I'm liking this game a lot better than the last game I did. Definitely. For sure. Oh, got caught in that Nami bubble. Nami is very good with those bubbles, and I'm very bad at dodging them. My Nami bubble skill... Bubble dodging skills are bad, and I feel bad. So I've got two placed. I'm going to go ahead and plant one over there. Oh, and he's going to ward up with me. This Ramus is amazing. I like this Ramus. Emerald for insight. I think they think we're doing Baron. We're not. Nah, they can't think we're doing Baron. That's way too early for that. You do have enough for that. I have enough. I'm gonna go ahead. No, I can. No, that'd be silly. I am gonna go ahead and start working on my Shirelias though, like I mentioned. And I'm not sure what else I want, honestly. I'll have to think about it. After I get my Shirelias, we'll see what I end up getting. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of those and another green ward as well. Just so I can ward up a bit more. It looks like they're gonna go ahead and get Dragon. Unfortunately, I'm way up here. Oh, right! Boots! That's what I'm gonna get next, because I really should have done that before starting Shirelias. Yup. I'll remember Boots one of these times, I promise. I promise. Oh no! The Ash Arrow! Unfortunately, I'm so slow because I don't have boots! I might be able to get there in time to help her. Nope. Nice. Timo is just taking lots of shots to the face, apparently. Okay. That's fine. It's, it's uh... Sapphire. So we're going to go down here and push, it looks like. Top is pushing really well, which is good. And... We're pushing decently, I think. Okay. I do want to go ahead and plant this ward up here so we don't get ganked. And unfortunately, my other sightstone wards are disappearing again. I'm going to go ahead and plant it at red as I see Jarvan over there. So I can go ahead and get vision of their jungle again. And this one... I'll go ahead and put this one, like, here. Oh, cool. There we go. Oh, so there's that. Ramus is coming up here. I'm going up there to help him on the off chance he needs me, but I don't think he will. He should be fine. He's probably gonna back off, as he should. Yes. Oh, he is going in. Did he get it? Did he get it? No, he didn't get it. Demo. Timo! What is he? He is Bruiser Timo. Awesome. And you're stuck. Nice. So we all took a little bit of damage from that, but not that much, really. Oh, he's... <laughs> he stayed out there a little too long. Kayla's pushing bot. Oh, hey. Gotcha. Go ahead and pull out the locket. Nobody dies. And Kayla's still just pushing bot. That is awesome. So we're going to get that tower easily. And I'm going to go ahead and heal him up. We are gonna grab this tower. Yeah, we probably 
to fall back. Have some more health, sir. Kale is still pushing down bottom, and we're keeping them mostly occupied here, but they are going in on Kale now. So I'm going to come down to hell. Let's just, nope, nope, can't go that way. That, that way is closed to me now. I'm going to come around behind, though. Hey, dude. I'm expecting that one! Gotcha! Okay. There we go. I tanked that for long enough. And we're gonna get this in him. And we're gonna go and get this in him, too. I hope. I have no mana. Timo's going in on that. I'll let them continue with this. I'm gonna go in on that with him. Ah! Timo is not going in on that. Timo is laughing in front of that. Hey, I got the kill. Okay. So I think we're gonna win this one. Hey, dude. No. You don't get to do that. That's GG. So yeah, I am going to be silver whatever. We'll see in a moment. That's the end of this game. That is GG. Oh, didn't get to do it. Uh, let's go ahead and see, guys. Ready? Here we go. There we go. I am now silver two. So, I am no longer silver three. I have been promoted, and it is indeed to silver two. I did not skip it. But, that's fine. I am out of silver three, and I am happy. And today is a good day. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed this game, and I hope you enjoyed this second promotion series, or uh, third promotion series that I've shown. This is the second one that I've shown all the games for. But, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I shall see you guys next time. Have a good night. Bye.